Check that four in a row. For the first time in the common draft era, four receivers come off the board in order. The latest Jordan Addison to the Vikings at number 22. The best wide receiver in college football from two years ago at Pitt. Transferred to USC where he tallied six touchdowns in his first four games of the season before tapering off down the stretch due to a lingering injury. He now joins a receiving core that features Justin Jefferson. All right, so a fourth consecutive wide receiver off the board. It is a run on wideouts here in the 20s. Jordan Addison, the latest to the Vikings, and we need a grade with our guy Pete Prisco. Pete, life's going to be pretty easy when you're breaking <laughs> that huddle and running the opposite way or next to uh, Justin Jefferson. How do you like the fit here? Got to be easy pickings here uh, for the USC product. Yeah, I love this. I love this pick because look, he's to me, he's the best receiver in this draft class. Uh, when you pop on the tape, he runs so smoothly when it comes to his route running. He knows how to come in and out of his breaks. Uh, and I think he just fits with what the Vikings want to do. Remember, they lost Adam Thielen. Uh, they still have Osborne, but they need to get better taking away more of the coverage uh, from Justin Jefferson. I think Addison will do that. Uh, it's a great pick for the Vikings. I give it an A. All right, it's an A from Pete Prisco. Uh, let's get a word here from our guy Ryan Wilson, who has chewed the tape for months, if not years, on this young <laughs> man. I mean, we're talking about a, a Blitnikoff Award winner two years ago. Uh, he had a nice start at USC, but things sort of tapered there down the stretch. Addison, now a Viking and you put him next to Justin Jefferson, I mean, that is going to be the best learning scenario any wide receiver could ask for. Just like Justin Jefferson a few years ago, learned from Adam Thielen. Yep. And now J.J.'s turn uh, to pass to, to pay it forward. And they, here's the thing about Jordan Addison, you mentioned this. Two years ago, he was with Kenny Pickett and Pitt. Yep. Last year, Caleb Williams at USC had more yards with Kenny, Kenny Pickett, Pickett, which yep. is hard to get your brain around when you watch Caleb Williams, who's going to be, we'll be talking about him in 12 months. But here's the other thing with the Vikings. They had needs at edge rusher. Yep. Miles Murphy's still out there. We'll see. Had needs at cornerback. Had a long run on cornerbacks, but they were still Joey Porter Jr. Mm -hmm. But they said, you know what? We got one wide receiver left that we probably have in our tier one. It's Jordan Addison. Mm -hmm. We're going to get him. 173, uh, excuse me, uh, yeah, he weighs 173, I believe, and he ran 449, which he was upset about. Yeah. Plays so much faster than that, B Mac. B Mac, you subtract Thielen, uh, you add Addison. Is this offense better than it was the one that Ooh. we saw a season ago in your no, eyes? I'm not going to say that right. just yet. Because Adam Thielen, older but extremely experienced, mm -hmm. consistent, had a relationship with the quarterback and Kirk Cousins. If you look at this team right now, clearly wide receiver depth was an issue. You have Justin Jefferson, K.J. Osborne, the next best up, Jalen Rager, right, who, right. Had, who was, really hasn't established himself so far on the professional level based on the expectations for him being a former first-rounder as well. So Went right before Jeff, Justin Jefferson to the Eagles. Exactly, exactly, to the Eagles. So clearly adding more weapons to their offense was a necessity. And also, we don't know exactly what's going to happen with Dalvin Cook. Remember, his name has been sprinkled in trade rumors or potentially getting released as well. So I'm not going to say just with the addition mm -hmm. of Addison, this offense will be better than what we saw last year, a playoff offense that was a year ago. But clearly, Jordan Addison was the next best wide receiver available. This was a huge need for them, and they went out and got their guy. Yeah, you talk about a guy like Thielen and all those one-score games that the Vikings won a year ago had his fingerprints all over that, that veteran presence. Uh, we'll see if Addison can fill in uh, that loss of Thielen here in the year to come. And what a 20 minute stretch it was mm. here. Four wide receivers in a row for the first time in the common draft era. Smith and Jigba goes first and then the dominoes fall. Johnston, Flowers and now Addison.